Hey finders, welcome back to Fortune Finds. It is my favorite kind of video day, a lip swatch video. So today I'm going to be swatching the Pat McGrath Mini Matte Trance Lipsticks. You get three lipsticks all in the red pink family. That has sequins in the package, in Mike's car, all over the house. Sorry, babe. Mini baby lipsticks. And just for comparison reasons, your standard MAC lipstick compared to the Pat McGrath mini lipstick. So again, you get three, $25 at Sephora. So I'm wearing the shade Obsessed, a beautiful red leaning on the blue side. This is a red that will look good with any skin tone. It does feel really nice going on. It does glide on very smoothly. It's not a liquid lipstick though. Like it's going to transfer. So if you're out with your boyfriend, your girlfriend, and you kiss them, it's gonna be on them. There was literally red lipstick all over Mike's face last night because we went out to dinner and I wore this and every time he would give me like the slightest little peck there was red lipstick all over him don't make out in this lipstick because it's going to end up all over you and whoever you're making out with it does last a really long time i sat through dinner last night it did not budge and i did not need any touch-ups so i think that these lipstick formulas are pretty foolproof they're nice they're long wearing am i blown away by them no i think that the hype is not real for these lipsticks but the colors are very very beautiful and i think that it would be well worth it to go to sephora try out some pat mcgrath lipsticks swatch some colors on yourself and then see which one looks the best and maybe just buy like a staple red or a staple nude you really just need one lipstick from pat mcgrath i feel like it's not as luxurious as maybe their eyeshadows are. Let's go ahead and take this lipstick off. Now, you know it's real love. I have had nothing but a headache when it comes to red lipstick swatching on my channel. Like, I did it once and it was a effing disaster. You guys know I love you. I wouldn't just put gobs of red lipstick on my face, take it off and get it all over the rest of my makeup for just anyone. It's all about the like removal precision. All right, my friends, that's the best it's gonna get. So here is Obsessed, the shade I just had on my face and took off. Okay, next up is the shade Elsin, which is definitely a deeper, more like vampy red. I love this red. Now with these lipsticks, I do like to use a lip liner. They're not like easy to line the lips with. If you are meticulous about your lips and how lined they are and how good they look, then you're definitely gonna wanna use a lip liner. I just think that these are very they're matte but they're like very smooth and they go on kind of like slippy they're hard to control and maneuver also they bleed so this is a very creamy matte lipstick which is not a bad thing i don't like very drying matte lipsticks but they're super creamy so just beware that it will travel through the fine lines around your mouth and that's not cute like it just makes you look older and it makes you look like you don't know how to put lipstick on i personally this is my favorite shade out of the whole thing. Love Elsin. I feel like this is very rock and roll. It's a very beautiful, beautiful red. I feel like this is just my kind of red. This would look great on anyone, whether you have a fair complexion, a dark complexion. Like, this is just a great color. Let's take this one off, and then we have one more left, which is this hot pink color, which I haven't worn yet, so I'm excited to see what it looks like. Oh, this reminds me of MAC Candy Yum Yum. And this is the shade Full Panic. I really do like this shade overall would i recommend buying this trio no i bought it because one i'm a lipstick fanatic and two i just feel like everyone has been like talking about pat mcgrath like non-stop pat mcgrath is like all the rage every time i go on instagram there's a pat mcgrath ad it's i don't it's like constantly in your face so i was really curious to try it out now that i tried it out i'm not impressed like there are a lot of lipsticks that I love a lot more. In fact, I said when applying this that this reminds me of Candy Yum Yum. Granted, that is a brighter pink than this one, but it's kind of like the same overall effect and vibe that it's going for. I like the MAC one more. Full size Pat McGrath lipstick retails for $38. $38 Pat McGrath or $17 MAC. I'm gonna definitely spend the $17 on MAC, not because it's cheaper, but because it's just a better lipstick in my opinion. I think I was expecting something that was more groundbreaking. When it comes to a red, I like a lot of red drugstore lipsticks at the moment. I have been nonstop reaching for my Maybelline Vivid Hot Lacquer Gloss in the shade Classic Love. It is so beautiful, and look, my whole arm is pink from this damn swatch video. 
the Wet n Wild Liquid Katsu in the shade Flame of the Game. Love this one as well. And these retail for less than $10. So if I'm going to suggest any kind of red lipstick to you, it's going to be one that is an eighth of the price. So that's just where I landed with this lipstick. I don't hate it. It is $25, so it's not like pennies, but you are getting three different shades. And if you are in the market for a red or a pink lipstick shade and you're not sure what would look good on you, this is like a fun try on three, see which one looks the best and maybe buy it. But for me, like I have so much lipstick that I'm not gonna buy a Pat McGrath lipstick. Like I don't think ever again. I mean, don't hold me to it. Pat McGrath comes out with like some sparkly, crazy, innovative lipstick. Like I'm gonna try it, but right now I'm not impressed. But be sure to let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. Do you like any of these lipsticks? Do you own Pat McGrath lipsticks? Do you like them? Do you not like them? What are your thoughts? What was your favorite shade that I tried on today? Whether it be the one that looked the best on me or maybe one that you wanna buy, let me know down below. If you like this video, be sure to leave it a big thumbs up down below. Also, if you are not yet subscribed, please be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm a heavy review channel, but I love doing swatch videos like this. Like this is a review, but I love lipstick swatch videos. I am like a lipstick freak. And click the bell button this way you get a notification every time I upload a video here on my YouTube channel. As always, I had a great time and I'll see you in the next one. Bye finders. Mwah.